What's going on? It's Alexander here, back with some more Assassin's Creed Odyssey. And, well, let's start helping our old friend. The issue he got is going on this time. I'm surprised there hasn't been a new leader picked yet. You look like you're having fun. The gods work fast. I wished someone as beautiful as me were here, and you arrived. It's almost unfair for the both of us to be in one place. It'll make everyone else feel bad. Oh, don't worry about them. These poor fools have accepted their fate. The gods decided many should lack in beauty while you and I bathe in it. You do realize the sun is out, right? Yes, what about it? Starting a bit early, aren't you? Starting? No, no. This is ending in the most spectacular fashion. Another successful party, then? The only kind I know. Although I have a slight problem. There's an important politician here who really needs to get back home. But gods know I can't make the trip. I'll make sure he gets home safe. Yes, safe. Right, it should be an easy trip, although you may have to carry him at this point. Lucky man. You could let him stay here. I would, but it's never good to let a politician stay the night. It's a rule of mine. I'm surprised you have rules. Oh, you know how they can be. Never want to stop talking. There's only so much I can take. But for you, I'd break all of my rules. What has he done to be so special? Well, he, uh... It was something to do with people, I think. Gods, I don't know. You may as well ask me what I ate ten days ago. So, you party often? As often as I can. I'm not sure how you do it. Practice, practice, practice! The more I do, the better chance of having a clearer head than those around me. So you're looking to gain an advantage? Over my allies? Never! <gasps> Actually, let's not talk about such things. I'll try to get the politician home before he completely passes out. Wonderful! Uh, just take him north of the port of Piraeus. His home is somewhere around there. <laughs> All right. We're calling the horse on this one. Oh. I think this is the start of Alcibiades' last quest line that we have for him. Now the world is spinning and bouncing. And I think this is the start of his last quest line. All right. Wait. Where are we going? This way. Why did you bring me here? Because I was told to. Is this really what it's exactly like we were told. Get him! She's in my sights! Hello? Okay, I guess I thought there was a cutscene there, but I guess not. Whatever.
this way. Which actually, I do believe we have a new uh, skill. Yep. And the higher we are, the more powerful that sucker is. <laughs> At least from what I from what I understood about it, it's basically a quick "how do you do" when when we jump in, you know. Then we can jump into a fight with a quick "how's it going." <laughs> of appearing the moment I need you. What a power I may wield. Is there ever a time you don't need me? Good point. The drunk politician you had me take home? We ran into a bit of trouble. That's terrible. I'm glad to see you're okay. Yes. Thankfully, we both made it out alive. Oh, I see. <laughs> Thank you for telling me. You seem disappointed. I'm just uh, impressed you were able to save the both of you. You said you needed something? Ah, to business already. Fine. It's simple, really. There's an item that holds great sentimental value I'd like you to retrieve. What do I need to find? It's an Olisvos. If you saw it on the ground, even you wouldn't bend over uh, to pick it up. But it means so much to me. To hold it again would mean more than you know. I never took you for someone who cared for sentimental things. I'm so much more than my beautiful face and flowing blonde locks. Like what? Well, let's see. People forget I'm an orphan, that Pericles isn't my father. I know what it's like to lose family, too. Ah, <sighs> we have that in common. There's more to you than I thought, Miss Dios. Now, where were we? You're a big boy. Get it yourself. I sure am. But there's a small chance the woman who has it won't exactly be happy to see me again. There has to be a story behind this thing. When you see the Olisvos, you'll know. When you have it in your hands, against your skin, when you feel the weight of it, you'll know. Every time we talk, it seems like you're about to sleep with someone, or want to, or you've just finished. Is this woman the most recent one? Who said I slept with her? It was a safe guess. How do you find yeah. time for anything else? Determination, mostly. There's a closeness <laughs> you can only feel with someone in those moments. Who wouldn't crave that? I'll get the olive bus for you. There's a small chance the woman may wish to keep it for herself, uh, to spite me. It may be best to go unseen and hurry back. She lives east of here. Don't worry. You'll have it in your hands soon. It's made out of stone. Oh, we already got it. Work. Ah, that's it in your hand. You've brought it. Hmm, it's different than I remember it looking. And much bigger, too. She's going to miss it. This was never yours, was it? You had me steal it. We didn't just steal an Olisvos. We stole a family heirloom and a husband's confidence. Without it, he'll be focused on his wife instead of his business. I think she'll enjoy the change of pace. <laughs> Honestly? So it is sentimental. Just not to you. The only thing that matters is you retrieved the Olisvos and helped me a great deal. What about me? Now, now, we wash each other's backs, don't we? There's a reason you never turn me down, after all. <gasps> I've turned you down always. I'll show you how this Olisvos can make all the difference. I'll pass. That's not what I meant. Guess I can turn you down after all. I deserve that. <laughs> uh. All right. Where's this next quest? All the way down here, it seems. Uh. I'm gonna miss these little talks <laughs> with Alchemiades. Yeah. Oh.
Alright. Because I believe we only have two or three more quests left for him. What? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh. See what he's up to this time. And who he's up to. A power I wield indeed. I told you last time I thought I could summon you when needed. And it has happened yet again. And for what this time? My friend here needs to be taken to the sanctuary of LFCs, near the border of Mecharis. He'll finish the trek across the border on his own. He. So, do you want to lie to me now or later? Whatever do you mean? Is this friend of yours actually a friend? I'm not going to find out they're a wanted criminal or they don't actually want your help, am I? I'm hurt that you jump straight to accusations. A relationship must be built on trust, after all. You'd rather lie than trust me. Some things are better left unsaid, and many things are for your own protection. I can protect myself, you know that. Fine, I'll try to be more forthcoming in the future. Let's get to it. I'm just supposed to take your friend across the border. Yes. Nothing else? Carefully, if you can. Avoid roads, people. Be invisible. My friend must be kept safe. I'll make sure he's safe. I'd hoped you'd say that. Every time you ask me to do something secretly, someone dies. What is it this time? Not everyone was born with your beautiful muscles built for... well, everything. Some of us work better by avoiding fights. This time, that's all I ask. There are lots of safe passages through these parts. Tell your friend to go alone. He could, but imagine if something happened and you saved him. Imagine the things I do to show my gratitude. And why do you always turn to me? You've proven yourself worthy. Plus, I like watching you walk away. We should be on our way. He needs to get to the sanctuary of LFCs. It isn't far, although it may take you longer than usual. It won't be a problem. I'm glad we aren't going by sea. All right. Hal Kiriades told me about you. He said you're blessed by the gods. Let's just follow her. Follow him. Do, 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 do. We're asked to avoid fights, so you might want to check to see if that one was one of the ones in our way we're not going to. We should stay on the safest route possible. I'm following you. I'm here to step in when things go sideways.
There we go. Not surprised things went sideways. I think there's an entire there's a regiment here to step in for us. We could have just stepped back on that one. of you to notice. Alkibiadis said... Exactly what I told him to. It was safer that way. I owe Alkibiadis a lot for his help, and for trusting you with my life as well. Enough lies. Tell me what's happening. I said I was a man, so nobody would recognize me. I needed to escape my husband unseen. And you trusted Alkibiadis? No one escapes my husband. He'd find me. It's been tough. I'm not sure I would have lasted much longer. So let me guess. Algibiadis owed you a favor, or now has some scheme where you owe him? I'm not sure what you mean. He didn't ask anything of me, and I've never known him to do so. I know many people he's helped at the expense of nobody but himself. I'm glad that could help. Please give Algibiadis my thanks. I only wish I had more to offer him. And you, for the help. I'll never forget either of you. All right. He's obviously doing something. He has something going on to help people. Because, like, there was the thing where we stole that one dude's stuff where he'd focus less on his business, more on his wife. Now he helps some dude's wife escape. From what could only probably be something uh, like a bad marriage. The sun and moon combined could not grant the beauty that my bride to be was gifted. If the gods blessed me, they did so with one eye closed. But their eyes were wide open for her. Please stop. Your poetry is sweet enough to make someone vomit. I won't stop until the whole world knows how I feel. So, you're in love? Yes, the wedding nears, and there is so much to be done. If you need help, I'm here for you. Accepting before knowing what I ask of you? That's a rare surprise. I do still need a few things. Food for an offering, a ring, and some flowers. If you could bring them to my bride, Iris, she'll make use of them. I've known you for a while now, but you've never mentioned Iris. There's plenty I haven't mentioned. I'm sure you could say the same to me. So what is it about Iris that turns you into, well, what I saw? You're not jealous, are you? Don't worry, she's very open. I suppose that's one of my favorite things about her, the openness. So, flowers, a ring, and food. Where can I find Iris? She should be at the Altar of Love. Aptly named, don't you think? Oh, and uh, don't be too taken by her beauty. These flowers should be good enough for the wedding. I kind of sort of may have got a lot of that already. Uh, Where do I get all that stuff from? A ring of... So she found but of luck and found in the northwestern part of the siege plains. Right there. I have no clue where we're gonna get the rest of this stuff, but maybe she'll know. Oh at the altar of love. Oh, even better. They're literally at the altar of love where we gotta go. But alright, with that, I'm going to end this here. Thank y'all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one where we find this stuff and give it to Al Kibiati's bride-to-be. So yeah, thanks for watching, and see you then.